Welcome to Changsha, China. We're here in BYD's factory, and today we're going to do a factory tour. Come join me. You can see we're in China with the Chairman Mao statue right behind us. We're going to go up to level two, where there are trams. They're going to bring us to tour this factory, making several models of hybrids and battery electric vehicles. Click subscribe to stay updated to more videos on EVs. Welcome to the BYD Changsha factory tour. There are a large contingent of us from Singapore, from Malaysia, from Hong Kong, and it also includes BYD's team and the distributors as well. You can see all of us are here in carts. We're ready to go. There's a tunnel right in front of us. And thus begins the tour of BYD's factory in Changsha. Let us see how ordinary plates are made into a You can see all the missionaries here. Please sit tight. Now we start the experience of electric green dream of BYD. Changsha Stamping Factory. That's a stamping now area. Now visit the first process of automobile production stamping technology. The area of Changsha Stamping Factory is 60,000 square meters. The stamping process is to separate and deform the purchased steel planks on a stamping machine. And so you'll be a flat sheet going from one end, and, and it comes out being cut, cut, cut. To obtain the required exterior components of the car body, Changsha Stamping Phase One plant has 15 large and medium-sized press models from 630 tons. Yeah, to you can see the stamping tons. machines is going Maybe through, cutting the different pieces. There's small pieces on the ground, on the ground, and that's the final Our output. Cabin. You can see that's the the front bonnet of the car the right down there. The automation system was added to the and what the workers are doing is they're doing QA testing line. to make Did sure that. There are no defects in the pieces. These are actually quite light. You can hold it eat one in each hand. And you can see all the completed stamping pieces over there. Pretty cool, right? You see how a car is being made like Lego. Over here, they, they wheel the different parts together. You can see all those machines working autonomously. The humans feed the pieces to the machines. Does look a bit dark here. Definitely, some additional lighting can be helpful. So that's one contrast you may notice with other factories when you tour them around the world. You can see the side panels here. Here you can see the front seats, the second row seats. Next, we will visit the second process of automobile production, welding process. The floor of the Changsha welding factory is 300 And you see that's the second level on top. So once it's welded, all those pieces move to the next part of the factory where the workers will start assembling the interiors as well. Coming in like a conveyor belt. You can see all these cars down here. And for all EVs, the batteries will marry together with the chassis later on. After being welded into one, it is like a human skeleton, which is the outline skeleton of a car. Because there is no color yet, we call it the body of white. The Changsha Welding Factory has Phase 1 plant and Phase 2 plant. And now we go to the and next part, you can see a lot more brighter lights as the machine phase starts painting the car. It's pretty cool to have a dedicated tour around in this factory. You can start smelling the paint already. So here is where they start painting the, the body in white. Which greatly reduces labor intensity and improves the quality of the appearance of the body. The next area is a flexible production line for vehicle body. There are 273 robots in total, which can complete. They the normally won't the allow tours inside the paint shop itself just to maintain quality and cleanliness. The production you can see these are some of the final outputs that come out from this factory. Front door assembly welding workstation. New floor assembly welding workstation. And this is our factory, BYD Changsha. As well as lower and main body It is a high capacity, high flexibility. And right in front you've got the you can see the sign that says first line interior section. So now the, the cars are coming to a shape of how a consumer would typically see a car. 
Mm -hmm. Look at that. All these that you see here are real cars that are going to be delivered to real consumers in the coming weeks. You've got an MPV there, you've got a sedan here. So you notice how in the same line, there are multiple different chassis and cars being made together. Now they are starting to install the internal wiring. So the line is moving at a gradual pace. Every worker typically has around a minute to complete the station. You can see now it's bringing the, the front dashboard to the car. Further down here, you see all the, the wiring for the car as well. And you notice there's a paper over there, the checklist, just to make sure that every step goes in hand by hand. Over time, as BYD digitizes, they should change a physical checklist into a computer screen, either in a car center console or a console from just the factory itself. So we'll see how that goes. You can see a second level above as well. All those cars above and all those cars below heading in different directions. You can see that it's still quite labor intensive. There's still a lot of humans putting the car together at this stage of the assembly line. All those wirings, cables, tubes. And look at how close we are to the entire production line. Magical. You see the MPV. And all the different parts of the, the car are over here. So it's, it's great to just see the behind the scenes of how they're building this together. So that's a lift to lift the car up and down different levels. You can see the cars being carried. The team here is working on the undercarriage and the, the battery is being married into the car as well. So you see the battery pack at the bottom. The batteries are a skateboard. And BYD is known for their blade battery, one of the safest in the world. It's safe because they are almost puncture proof. You puncture it and it won't explode or catch fire. So look at how the team marries the, the battery and the chassis of the car. The battery is half the weight of the entire car. That's the front motor going to the car. And that's the rear motor. So you see the motors coming into the car right now. So these are dual motor, all wheel drives. Again, at this stage, you still see a lot of humans in the factory. Over time, there will be more automation in BYD's factories. Look at the car coming down. That's our Denza D9. These are sedans. The team is just putting final finishing touches in the undercarriage of the car. Just protecting the battery with another layer below it. And you can see the whole car coming much more into shape right now. Above, you can see all the door panels. They get installed in the cars here. 
Uh, you can see that different colors uh, mixed together in the line. These are uh, not a model we'll find in Singapore. Yes, as we make that turn, we get a front view of the production line just coming towards us. There's another level below where you see additional cars down there. Cars being lifted, raised up by the lift. And down here you've got basically final inspection where the team presses the horn, checks the horn work, all the basic safety features. You can see the staff going through a paper checklist to make sure that everything is good to go before going to the delivery parking lot. Again, final inspections are happening over here. Everything's installed in the car, the computers, the motors, the batteries. They're testing the lights. So you can see testing being done stage by stage across this final inspection line. You can see that some are ice cars, you still see a petrol tank in there. So it's a combination of pure ice cars, hybrids, and also battery electric vehicles. And BYD will eventually phase out all ice cars and be very focused on EVs, battery electric vehicles. Down here we just have, it's almost a parallel line, like a line two, for these vehicles going to the final inspection further down where we came from. Let me know what you think about this factory tour. Leave comments down in the video description. I know many of you come from the automotive industry, former engineers yourself, worked in different companies. We'd love to hear what you like, what you're curious about, and what you do differently. Let's take a look, the wheels are being installed here. They're coming down like a pinball machine. It's so surreal to be so close to BYD's production line. We're so thankful for their team to allow us to visit the Changsao factory. It's a fun fact. The reason why they have a factory in Changsao is because BYD's founder grew up in Changsao and it's a great way to give back to the local community. You can see a, a robot there. Team putting in different parts. This building is one structure among many, many structures in the entire factory campus here in Changsa. You'll see a map next to me describing all the structures. We even saw a 7-Eleven in this campus. The robots follow a line. You can see the, the magnet lines down there. That guides all these robots to carry equipment or spare parts, supplies to all the workers. There are even worker rest areas and all these benches down here as well. So you can see one of these robots live in action, carrying it's like a train, carrying a tray of all different equipment. Here you can see the label, second line interior section. This is the, tw uh, the map of the entire factory in front of us. You see level one level above, one level here and one more level below. Basically three parallel levels working together. Down here as we come to a stop, you can just see again the, the pace at which the line moves and every worker is just working, specializing in their section to install the parts that they are working on while waiting for another robot carrying equipment just to cross the path. Everything we see here goes into a vehicle.
it's based on observation number of people we see just in these two lines, I imagine there are at least 30,000 human employees in this whole factory campus. Could be much more. And it looks like we're ending the tour. What we're going to do next is it's going to have a montage as we go back to where we started. Take a look again at the production line where we came from. And you can see right now we're here in a cart where media from Singapore in this cart, media from Hong Kong and Malaysia, are all given an opportunity to learn about the machine that makes the machine. How BYD makes these vehicles that we can trust, mm. put on the road, mm. because BYD is one of the top selling EV brands in many countries around the world today. You can see, look at, look at how big this place is and all the exterior portions. They even have their own monorail for employees to use inside this campus. You can see in a wall, just on the side, just a little bit more about what they're proud of, sustainability, or their, their philosophy, their values, their milestones. It does feel a little bit like a Disneyland amusement ride yeah, with a dedicated path or like a Tron ride. In some parts, you can smell paint because we may have passed through a paint shop. Again, we're coming back to the body in white, all the body panels that are welded together. And right after this, we'll go back to where, again, all these individual pieces are stamped together. Look at all these machines welding the pieces together before they go into the main assembly line where the humans put all the pieces in there. You can see here right body side, there's another section for left body side. You all see over time more and more automation in factories around the world, not just BYD, but every car manufacturer as well. So we're back in the stamping line. Again, what you're seeing now is the final output. As we go further down, you see the raw pieces. All the cut pieces go on the ground. They get recycled. They get put back in the, the front again as a flat sheet so that we can reuse as much of the material as possible. What I look forward to seeing too in BYD's factories are giga press, giga stamping machines so that 70 individual parts can just be one single part giving better structural integrity, lower cost and higher scalability. And here we are, back where we started. I hope you enjoyed this short tour of BYD's factory in Changsa. It's been an amazing experience. I can see all the carts behind us coming back. I think you're going to hear a lot of different perspectives from content creators, large media channels, and also our dis distributor and dealer partners as well. I'm very thankful for this experience. Thank you so much again to the BYD team for this. So as we head out, you can see that we've got professional film crews like CNA on our side. We've got people holding small DJI cameras. And all of us are done. We're now going to head to the Denza D9 factory rollout, which is going to highlight. There'll be a live stream at 11 a.m. today. For the rest of you, if you found this video useful, please click the like button and hit subscribe to stay updated to more videos on EVs.